Did you see that? Yeah, it's a fly. I got this. No, I got this. I mean, it was around here just a second ago. What? Jay? Don't move. What? Just stay still. It's on my face, right? Just don't worry. It doesn't bite. But stay still. But relax. Wait. Ow. Ash. Missed it. Sorry, bro. Ash. Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. There it is. Mm. Yes. Ugh. Excuse me! Excuse me, please. Am I, I, I asking for too much? I'm looking for my son. Please, please, just look. Just look. His name is Dele. Dele Adibola. He, he, he said he was with one coyote. And that was the last I heard from him. If I can just get the coyote, maybe I will know where he is. Please. Please, I'm begging you, please. Do you know where he is? What kind of stupid This is true. He needs to come Please, now. Please. Who are you? My name is Martins. Martins Sonia. Okay. What is your relationship with him? I don't have any relationship with him. Do you want me to bring you in for questioning? No, please, please. Please, no. Then start explaining the drama you just acted. The guy is my student. I challenged him in the class. I guess he got provoked and... He came to challenge me. Mr. Martins, a lot is going on in this school. I'm here looking for a kidnapped boy, but everyone seems to be hiding something. The registrar and you, the lecturer. What are you all hiding? I am not hiding anything. Is he in a cult? Yes, he is. Are you in a cult? No, I'm not. Then why do you know so much? How come you know so much? Look, it's a long story. Make it short. It all started a long time ago. I discovered my father was a cultist. He 
killed my mother. And use that for nutrients. He also was. Hold on. Ma? Hold on. I'm not a fan of horror films. Okay, so let's put the story on hold to be continued. That's the person I'm looking for. Here's my card. In case you have something new to share. Not season film standard, please. Ah, Dilly. You know him? Ah, of course, I know him. He was my student. He was kidnapped three days ago. Yes. We are looking for him and others. Call me when you find something. What, what, what about that guy? He can run, but he can't hide. He's in my radar. There are kingdoms in this world, but we belong to the kingdom of heaven. There are powers in this world, but we have the power. Guy, what happened? Uh, it be like say you don't jump ghost to. Baba, they follow you talk now. What happened? Uh, Why they look like look who said like this? Uh, Baba, follow me talk now. Yeah, they follow me talk now. You better watch this. You can do this, guy. Guy, talk to me now. What happened? What did you do you now? Sir? What is it? Someone is here for you. He said he is one of the parents of the kidnapped students. Bring him in. All right, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, my brother. Please, sit. I think I prefer to stand. In that case, I will stand with you, my brother. It's okay. My name is Barista Debola. I'm here to look for my son. We are looking for our children too. The police are on the lookout for them. And they've promised us that they will find them within the foreseeable future. Foreseeable future? Hmm. So, when is this foreseeable future going to be? That is the question. The exact question I have been asking. But they keep telling me that they are handling the matter. That the investigation is ongoing. The case is being handled. Nobody is actually saying anything. No one is speaking. They are all just saying they are handling the matter. They are handling the matter. I honestly, I'm tired. I'm tired. I don't know why all this is happening. Honestly, it's so tragic. It's so tragic. 
I've been shedding tears now for the past week. Look at my books, look at my files. All soaked with tears. I, I don't even know where to write anything now. Everywhere soaked. Everything messy and wet. So, what are we going to do now? God is my witness. We are going to take a stand and demand for answers. The police are trying to take us for a ride and we will not allow it. I make a vow to God and to you that I will not eat or drink anything until those missing children are returned to us. Uh, that is except, of course, for beverages, you know, tea, coffee, uh, perhaps some biscuits and the like. Well, thank you, Mr. Registrar. You actually got sent. Your son will return to you. I will fight tooth and nail to ensure that your son is returned to you. God helping me. I will take my leave. Uh, are you sure you don't want to spend some more time? I mean, it's, it's okay by me. No. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Have a good day, sir. No more parents. I said no more parents. I've closed shop. Man. Eyes are popping out. Barista Degbola, I don't appreciate you manning my gates. I mean, this is uncalled for. Is there any news? I told you I'll update you if there's any new development. <laughs> so, what you are saying is that there is no development? We are still investigating. That's what you have been saying for the past three days. You just sit in your office and you expect the boy to stroll in. Right? If you don't understand what we are doing, well, that's on you. But you have to leave now. Officer, that boy's life is at risk. The chances of getting him alive is getting slimmer every day. So you help me understand what you are doing. Barista Degbola. Officer, what have you done differently today from what you did yesterday? It is none of your business. <laughs> none of my business? That's my only son we are talking about here. So, it is my business. Will you take over the case then? If I can, I will. Fine. Fine. Take it over. Do your investigation. Get your son. Arrest the kidnappers. But don't you ever come near my house again. Leave. now. Did you enjoy school? Ah, 
any man where you see for that anger. Go now, down! Yes, boss. You hear me talk? No man standing! Rambo, Baba. What's going to happen? Get caught. Who be that? I'm not someone you mess with, Rambo. I'm not. What is it? What? 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 what, 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 what we had a deal. Why is it difficult for you to hold up the own end of the deal? I am working on it. You work, you're working on it? Just listen to your, your work. Your job was simple. Get me Martin Strosonia alive. Simple. That's all. He walks around freely in your school and you and your boys refuse to touch him. Like I said, I am working on it. <laughs> my time is my life, Rambo. My time is my life. You waste my time, I waste your life. Is that a threat? Ah, uh, no, 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 no. Threat? No, 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 no. See, I don't waste bullets. But I wasted one very close to your face. Now, the next time I see you, you won't have the eyes to see me. Now, that is a threat. Get me matches. Messenger sent to take you home. Hey, Sire, it is hey, time. Hey, hey. For, for what? Ha, ha, ha. To leave Earth. No, no. I'm not ready. Whatever has a beginning also has an ending. You have enjoyed the beginning. The end has come. No, 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 it cannot end this way. No, no. The powers that be have decided your fate. I am here to take you home. No, 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 I, 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 I am not going anywhere. The countdown has begun. You don't get to decide. So where are you going? Where are you going? To pack your things, of course. The end has come. I, I, I am not going anywhere. 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 No! No, I am not going anywhere. No! 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 Ah. We shouldn't be seen together. This is urgent. So urgent that you can't tell me on the phone? What do you know about Martin Sonia? Martin Sonia? Yes. He's an ordinary lecturer in our university. He resumed some days ago. That man is not ordinary. That man belongs to the upper chamber of the secret seers of the underworld. You are joking. See, you see love for my mouth. What is your evidence? He has been to a third dimension. That's impossible. Why? 
the only person who has the key to the third dimension, is the first in rank, holder of the secret seer, Chief Duro Sonya. Who is now exiled? Exiled. What do you mean exiled? He has been excommunicated. Oh. What if there is a second? His son, Martin Sawyer. No way. No way. Ah. Pass. That explains. That explains why there is a price on his head. There are powers that want him dead. Hmm. Yes, please get me Martin Sonia. It's very urgent, please. Hello, Barista Dibola. Baba Gwenlo. I need your help. I am scared. Don't be. It's been one week, Baba Guerrero. Anything can happen. The only thing happening is that <laughs> our boy will be found. He will be seen. How sure are you of this? Because he is a covenant child. When the hack of the covenant was kidnapped by the Philistines, and they took the hack of the covenant to the house of their god, Dagon, what happened? I can't remember. The Bible says early in the morning, the people arose and behold, Dagon was found head down to the ground before the Ark of Covenant. And the people went, took Dagon, and put him back in his position. <laughs> but again, the following day, Dagon was found head downward to the ground. And the head of Dagon and his two hands we are found lying down on the threshold. Only the trunk of Dagon was left to him. God is about to arise. Don't allow yourself to be scattered because that is the portion and the position of his enemy. The Lord will arise. And his enemies will be scattered in Jesus' name. Amen. It is well. It is well. It is well in Jesus' name. Hey, you! Sit down there! Let God arise and his enemies be scattered. Let God arise. Are you mad? I said, sit down. His enemies be scattered. Let God arise. It's and his enemies be scattered. Let God, let God arise. Good morning. Good morning, Good morning sir. All right. Um, my name is Mr. Martins, and I will be your invigilator. All right, so without further delay, we are going to be starting this exam. But I hope your bags and other things are out there, because I have zero tolerance for exam and practice. Once I catch you, you're out of here. Yes, All right? Yes. Now, you have, to, you have to close to each other. You, you move there. Hello? You move, move there. 
Yeah, just like that. Good. Spread out a little bit. Spread out, spread out, spread out. Good. Yes. And Jesus! Good morning, sir. Mr. Martins. What are you doing here? I'm here for the exam. What, what exam? This exam. Flora Esther Badmos. Yeah, move far away. From, move far away from her. Yes. Yes. Hello, sir. Right now. Okay, sir. Good morning, sir. Ah, Martins. Yes, sir. Good morning, sir. Start. Start what? You start. I'll continue. <laughs> continue what, sir? The creed. What creed? <laughs> you are a good actor, Mr. Martins. Very good. Hey, I'm sorry, sir. I don't, I don't understand. Okay, I will start. Then you continue. One blood, one heart, one soul stands for all, speaks for all. The stars make us who we are. The stars bind us as one. No blood, no glory. Surprised? <laughs> Sit down, Martins. Sit down. We are brothers. Sit! Uh, now that I have recited the creed, is that enough for you to put off this your acting? Huh? Look! The only reason why you have not seen me at conferences and meetings is because I still belong to the lower chamber. Uh, your father brought me in about uh, three years ago. There are only a few people in the upper chamber, uh, and I know that you are one of them. Ask me how I know. How, sir? The third dimension. It is only the first in rank, holder of the secret seer, that is able to ride in the third dimension. Your father is one, and you are the second. Your father has promised me a seat in the upper chamber for over a year now. But he has failed me severally. Uh, I put calls through to him, but he has refused to answer my calls. Mr. Martins, I want to sit with the people who matter. I want my voice to be heard in the corridors of power. Uh, this is my dream. Please. Connect me to the Grand Master. Excuse me, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. You know my father? Yeah, of course. He's my mentor. My father? Your mentor? Yes. Ah, who would have thought? Who would have thought that the son of the first in rank, holder of the secrets here, would be looking for a job here in my university? I mean, it's impossible. But, uh, please, grant my desire. Give me this connect. So, so, um, you know about the, um, the kidnappings? Kidnappings? Yes, yes, the, the kidnappings going on in this school. Hmm. Because... We are brothers. I can reveal some privileged information to you. I not only know about these kidnappings, I also know the kidnapper. That boy is a principality. People come from all over to give him money, operations, and jobs. Huh? Called members from other institutions come to pay homage to him, 
just because he has seen the Grand Master. Hmm, that is why I'm asking you for this connect. Um, um, do you know where the kidnapped victims are kept? Come on, Mr. Martins. I can't reveal that to you. It's really none of my business. Whenever I need a sacrifice, I just contact Rambo. R Rambo? Yes, Rambo. That's the name of the guy. The mastermind behind these kidnappings. Uh, I can give you his number in case you need to make any sacrifice. Sacrifice? Yeah, the annual sacrifice for the convention. Y yeah, yes, yes, his number. Please. Well, I'll give you his number. See, I know go lie, you that exam hard though. Ah. But you prepared so well now. Yes, I read so well, but the part I read did not come out. Ah. So what are you going to do now? My sister, what can I do than to trust God and get busy with his business? Ah, busy? Is he doing what? Remember I told you. That the Holy Spirit is sending me to this school to preach the gospel and to talk to people about him. Yes, yes. So I've started my ministry already. And since that's the reason I'm in this school in the first place. So you want to go around preaching to people? Hmm. Yes, yeah, so I've preached to 10 people already. Flora, when are you coming back home? It's remaining 40 people. Flora, 40. Uh -uh, yes, is it too small? Ha. What is Anne now? You know I'm just starting this thing. You're supposed to be encouraging me. Flora. What, Sandra? 40. All together, 50. 50? Don't worry, I'll get to your level one day. Hmm. Flora. Ha. Sandra, what now? Ah, hey. 50 is the total number of souls I minister to in a year. Ha, huh, auntie. I think I need to reconsider having you as my mentor. Uh -uh. Auntie, please, drop your resignation letter. Now which can't talk with that one now, eh? Ha, uh -uh. you they preach to 50 uh -uh. people in a year. And shame no catch you, Sandra. I beg, what you they talk, eh? How will I preach to 50 persons in one day? I no be say I no get work. Which work Jesus tell us make we can't do again? No be to talk. Flora, are you kidding me? Fifty souls in one day. Sandra, imagine say you they work for one company, and they tell you say they go give you one one thousand per person where you follow talk. How many people will you go talk to one day? I beg, I beg, I beg. I no be your student. No, no they follow me talk that kind of thing. Eh? I no be don't know they give me mathematics on phone. Sandra. Bible can't talk, say. There's joy in heaven over one sinner will repent. Than over 99 good persons we no need to. Oh, sister, as I follow you talk, you they waste my time. I need to go about God's business. Bye-bye. <sighs> Which kind of picking be this one? Hey, 50.
Want to die. Sir, you're not going to die. Ah, uh, he came for me? Who? The man. Who, who, who is the man? He was sent to pick me. I, I, I told him I was not ready. Oh, he's somewhere in this house. He said he went to pack my things. Uh, uh, sir, I, Frank. I am not ready. Sir, please, please, sir. Stop talking. Please. Tell him to get out of this house. Sir, please stop. Please <laughs> stop. Sir, you are not well. I know. I know. Then please, sir, let, let me take you to the hospital. No, no. The hospital does not have the cure for what is wrong with me, Frank. The hospital cannot drive that man out of my house. Only one person can. Who? Martins. Get me Martins. Sir, even if I know his location, he will not come here. Then let me die there. No, sir. No, sir. Please, let me take you to the hospital. Please. 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 Please, please sir. Please, sir. Please, let's go. Please, let's go to the hospital. Oh. Frank. Yes, sir. Look at this whole place. It's empty. I'm all alone. They have taken everything away from me. And sir, can we at least give the doctors a chance to do their job? Please, let's go. Oh, you're not listening to me. Sir, sir, you don't have a chance here. I'm not going to watch you die. So please, let me take you to the hospital. Ah! Hello? Hello, Mr. Frank. Yes. Olari, why'd you consume here? I have called you several times to speak to Chief, but you have refused to grant me access. And I've explained to you several times that the Chief is not available for any meeting at the moment. And why? None of your business, sir. <laughs> Tell him I know a little bit about his business. Tell him I know that he has been excommunicated banished, debarred. Tell him that if he refuses to honor my simple request, I will be left with no choice than to go with his son, Martins Duro Sonya. Wait, wait, wait. What? Um, did you say you will go with his son? Yes. He thinks I don't know that his son is presently on an undercover operation in this university as a lecturer. I met him today. We discussed at length. And he has promised to get me into the upper chamber of the secret seers of the underworld. From what I gathered, he's even more powerful than Chief. For he called down fire in the third dimension. So if you want to keep your boss, go ahead and keep him. Goodbye. Take me to him now.
Why are you persecuting me? Who are you? I'm Jesus. Why are you persecuting me? What do you want me to do? I will send my servant to you and she will tell you what you must do. I'm here to talk about our Lord Are you his servant? Sir? You said you will come. You are talking to the wrong person, sir. Mm. You said you will send the servant to me. So you are not a servant? I am nobody's servant, sir. I know my value and I know my worth. Uh, then it's not you. Uh, sir. Eh? Please. When your head is clear, find time to read this, sir. It is you. Uh, uh, this is the same question he asked me. And he said he will send you. Sir. Are you not his servant? I have a word for you. The Bible says, don't be drunk in wine because it will ruin your life. Instead, be filled with the Holy Spirit. Peace be unto you. Uh, 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 excuse me. Leave my hand alone. See. You are going to enter this room. The things I used to do, I do them no more. I will not enter into that room and sin against God. Never! Let me tell you, he told me you will come. I don't know when next you will come. So if he takes me to drag you to this room, I will drag you. In the name of Jesus, leave my hand alone. In the name of Jesus, enter this room and explain to me. Explain what? Who Jesus is? Ah, uh, Jesus? Yes. I saw him. Where? In my dream. See? He asked me the same question. Why am I persecuting him? He told me he would send his servant to tell me what to do. Are you his servant? I'm his servant. He's here, sir. He is? Yes, sir. Please bring him in. Bring him in. Ah, Chief, I'm so glad to. One blood, one soul, one heart stands for all. Where's my son? Don't you want us to recite the creed first, Chief? I didn't come here to recite some sort of nursery rhymes. I came here to see my son. Chief, what did I do to you? You are the one who brought me into this fraternity. You promised me that you would take me into the upper chamber of the secret seer. But for three years, you just abandoned me. Abandoned me in the lower chamber. Olan Rewaju. I do not have the time. Hey, but then you wasted my time? Why, Chief? I, I need to see my son. I thought he is in the upper chamber of the secret seer. Who told you that? My source. Your source? Who's your source? Rambo. Rambo? Who's Rambo? Rambo is a student. A student, not just a student. That boy is a principality. How? He secured audience with the Grand Master. And ever since then, people have been coming from all over to see him to buy sacrifices. Sacrifices? 
Have you not heard about the kidnappings going on on this campus, Chief? And you allowed these under your watch? All I want is to be in the upper chamber, Chief. All my mates, my colleagues, they are at the top. But look at me, Chief. I'm still here. After three years, an ordinary, ordinary registrar. For how long, Chief? How long? I am not here to listen to your tales. I am here to see my son. Can you get that done? Are you sure of all that you're saying? This man knows everything. This registrar, he knows everything. He knows the people. He knows the person in charge. He said his name is Rambo. He even gave me his number. Why was he sharing this information with you? He thought I was in a cult, the secret seer of the underworld. What kind of a cult is that? You don't want to know. Now, the cult has two chambers, the lower chamber and the upper chamber. The registrar belongs to the lower chamber and he needs a connect to get to the higher chamber. How do you know all this? My father is in the upper chamber. The upper chamber? Uh, yes, he's the first in rank and then... Um... Hold on, Martins. I need to control my information. Were you able to record something? No, I wasn't. I wasn't... I wasn't... So much shock, I couldn't even coordinate myself. I knew it. I knew there was something about him, something evil. I just couldn't place my hand on it. We need a strong evidence against him. We need to find something to pin on him. I mean, if this man knows everything that is going on, then he has questions to answer. Martins. Mm. This is our chance. We must not let it slide. Mm -hmm. But man, my God, I'm still in shock. <sighs> you have to put yourself together and get back to that office. Act as natural as possible and ask him more questions. I will go look for Coyote. He also has questions to answer. I let him off the last time, but he's very much on my radar. Yes. The registrar. Okay, okay, I will be there soon. I'm coming. Showtime. Paul, who is he? That man was responsible for the death of the followers of Christ. He destroyed the church. He went from house to house persecuting the followers of Jesus Christ. What did they do to him? <laughs> it's not about what they did to him. It's about who they stood for. Hey, who did they stand for? <laughs> they stood for Jesus Christ. Paul went to the high priest to seek for permission in order to persecute more Christians. His permission was granted. He was on his way to Damascus to persecute more Christians. That was where he met the light. The light? <laughs> yes, the light. Yeah, what is the light? It was the same light you saw yesterday. Jesus? Yes. The light of the world who shines in darkness. And darkness cannot understand. Is the way, the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through him. The same way he appeared to Paul is the same way he appeared to you. 
and he's asking you the same question. Why are you persecuting me? Exactly. Jesus Christ asked Paul that same question. Because he had a purpose for his life. I believe the reason he's asking you that question is because he has a purpose for your life. He does? Yes, he does. Can Jesus still use a sinner like me? After everything I have done? <laughs> if Jesus could still forgive me, despite my horrible past, you are not an exception. I am a cultist. I'm responsible for the kidnap of so many people. Hmm. I've watched people die right before my eyes. I was a prostitute. I framed up an innocent man for rape. And because of me, he landed in jail. He suffered for the offense he knew nothing about. I have ruined people's lives. I was a mess. But he still found me. He still gave me another chance. He told me to come to the university. I would never have thought in a thousand years. Me, a worthless prostitute who roams about the streets with no future, no dream. <laughs> I was already counting down to the end of my life. All around me was darkness, but he sought for me and cleaned me up. He gave me a new assignment, a new life and a new hope, a new dream. Who would have believed that I can dream again? But Jesus Christ gave me a new dream. He said before I was formed, he knew me. He said he has appointed me a prophet, me a former prostitute. Now a prophet, Jesus is knocking at the door of your heart. Now is the time to open up. I'm ready. I'm ready. Jesus, if you could save Paul, then you can save me. Oh. Save me. Father Lord, we thank you for your son. Thank you for showing him the light. Oh Lord, I ask that you come and cleanse all his sins. And you make him as white as snow. Good afternoon, ma'am. Afternoon, sir. The, the registrar asked me to see him. All right, hold on, sir. Hello, sir. Mr. Matthews is here to see you. Can you come in? All right, sir. Okay. You may go in, sir. Thank you. <laughs> Martins, Martins, Martins. <laughs> Hello, son. It's been a while.
There are kingdoms in this world But we belong to the kingdom of heaven